you're about to embark on a journey, one that takes you four light years away to a mysterious exoplanet called Proxima b. Recently, something extraordinary has been discovered on this distant world, and it's all thanks to the immensely powerful James Webb Telescope. Could this be conclusive proof that extraterrestrial life exists? Get ready for a thrilling adventure filled with exciting revelations as we explore the terrifying signs of life on Proxima b. Don't let gravity hold you down. Hit that like button and subscribe for an astronomical time. We'll take you on a space odyssey filled with cosmic puns and enough stardust to make you feel like the celestial superstar you are. Proxima b, an exoplanet located 4.24 light-years away, orbits Proxima Centauri, the star nearest to our solar system. Discovered in 2016, this fascinating world has caught the attention of scientists who believe it lies within the habitable zone of its star. But what makes Proxima b so special among the quadrillion planets in our galaxy? The answer, artificial light. Could it be that the inhabitants of Proxima b's dark side are not only alive but also technologically advanced? How do we even begin to explore this world that's light years away? Enter the James Webb Telescope, the biggest and most powerful space telescope ever built. Capable of seeing through interstellar clouds of dust, it's our ticket to unraveling the mysteries of Proxima b. The James Webb Telescope features enormous gold-coated mirrors that reflect infrared photons, generating an incomprehensible image. Proxima b is set to be one of the very first exoplanets observed by this incredible instrument. But what does it take for a planet to support life? Let's delve into Proxima b's unique features and compare it to Earth. Proxima b is 1.27 times the size of Earth and is 4.6 million miles from its sun compared to Earth's 93 million mile distance. Given that Proxima Centauri is 4,000 times fainter than the Sun and is located at a significant distance away from its star, do scientists think Proxima b could host life? According to scientists, Proxima b has a habitable zone, suggesting the presence of mountains and the potential for liquid water on its surface. With an orbital period of 11 days around its Sun, Proxima b is quite near to us in the cosmos. However, one side of the planet is always illuminated, while the other side is entirely dark. This unique characteristic makes Proxima b a valuable candidate in the search for alien life. So, what studies are being undertaken to establish whether Proxima b could support life? First, researchers are making an enormous effort to identify any artificial light coming from the planet's surface. Harvard University researcher Avi Loeb claims that the James Webb Telescope can artificially light both the bright and dark sides of Proxima b, assisting in the search for faint, practically undetectable light coming from both sides of the planet. Scientists are particularly worried that the side of Proxima b receiving the most X and UV radiation could severely affect the habitability of the planet. However, the search for alien intelligence presses on. The Allen Telescope is currently being used to search for signals from more than 200,000 red dwarf stars, with Proxima b at the forefront of their minds. A bizarre event occurred when the radio telescope in Sydney, Australia, detected an unusual radio signal from Proxima b. When the antennae were shifted away from Proxima Centauri, the signal was lost. What could this strange and cryptic signal mean? To analyze Proxima b as an exoplanet, scientists plan to launch a nanocraft, a first-of-its-kind mission. Given our current technology, no astronaut could traverse the vast distance required to reach Proxima b. However, this may change as the pioneering Starshot project continues its development. The $100 million project involves deploying a nanotechnology-equipped spacecraft to the Proxima b system. Powered by extraordinarily fast lasers, the nanocraft will travel at a speed that's around 20% of the speed of light, significantly reducing the time it would take to reach its destination compared to conventional speeds. The discovery of planets like Kepler 452b and Kepler 186f indicates the presence of Earth-like habitable worlds within our galaxy. According to a 2012 study, 22% of the stars in our galaxy have the same size as the Sun. Could there be Earth-sized planets orbiting any of these stars? It's estimated that 200 billion Earth-like planets may be habitable. While there is still much to explore and research, one thing is certain. 
there will always be unexpected discoveries in space, and the potential for improvement is limitless. As for Proxima B, it will be fascinating to monitor the unfolding events. How do you feel about the possibility that life may exist on the exoplanet Proxima B? If we do discover life on the planet, do you think they will be more technologically evolved than we are? What kind of challenges would we face in establishing contact with such a civilization? Furthermore, what ethical questions might arise if we were to interact with an extraterrestrial civilization? Would we be able to coexist peacefully, or might our differences lead to conflict? Our journey to Proxima B has been an exhilarating adventure, filled with tantalizing clues and mind-bending possibilities. As we continue to explore the cosmos with the help of powerful instruments like the James Webb Telescope, we inch closer to answering the age-old question, are we alone in the universe? The prospect of discovering extraterrestrial life has long captivated human imagination. Whether it's through the lens of science fiction or the rigorous pursuit of scientific research, we have always been fascinated by the idea that other forms of life may exist beyond our home planet. The search for extraterrestrial life encompasses not only the possibility of complex, intelligent beings, but also simpler life forms, such as microbes or plants. One of the most significant developments in this field has been the discovery of extremophiles, organisms that thrive in extreme environments on Earth. These organisms have expanded our understanding of the types of environments that can support life, opening up a wealth of possibilities for habitable worlds in the universe. Astrobiology is an interdisciplinary scientific field that studies the origin, evolution, and distribution of life in the universe. It combines elements of biology, astronomy, geology, and planetary science to investigate the potential for life elsewhere in the cosmos. Astrobiologists seek to understand the conditions necessary for life to emerge and thrive and apply this knowledge to the search for habitable planets and moons in our solar system and beyond. One of the key aspects of astrobiology is the study of extremophiles. By examining the adaptations of these hardy organisms, scientists can better understand how life might survive in seemingly inhospitable environments. This research is crucial when considering the potential habitability of other celestial bodies, such as Mars or the icy moons of Jupiter and Saturn. While the search for life on exoplanets like Proxima b is undoubtedly exciting, we must not overlook the potential for life within our own solar system. Several locations have been identified as potentially harboring life, including Mars, Europa, a moon of Jupiter, Enceladus, a moon of Saturn, and even the cloud layers of Venus. Mars, in particular, has been a significant focus of astrobiological research. Evidence of past liquid water, a key ingredient for life as we know it, has been discovered on the Martian surface. In addition, Recent findings suggest that there may be seasonal flows of salty liquid water on the planet's surface. Scientists are also investigating the possibility of subsurface water, which could potentially harbor microbial life. The discovery of exoplanets has revolutionized our understanding of the universe and has fueled the search for extraterrestrial life. With the launch of powerful telescopes like the James Webb Space Telescope, we can now study the atmospheres of these distant worlds in greater detail. By analyzing the chemical compositions of these atmospheres, scientists hope to detect potential biosignatures, chemical indicators of life. It is important to note that the search for extraterrestrial life is not limited to the discovery of Earth-like planets. Astrobiologists are also investigating the possibility of life on planets and moons with environments drastically different from our own. For example, some scientists speculate that life could exist in the subsurface oceans of icy moons like Europa and Enceladus, where hydrothermal vents could provide the necessary energy for life to thrive. And there you have it, space aficionados. We have ventured through the mysteries of the cosmos and flirted with the idea of alien life all while navigating the vast unknown. But just like our galactic journey, this video must come to an end. So before you blast off to your next adventure, don't forget to hit that like button with the force of a supernova. If you had an interstellar blast with us today, 
make sure to subscribe to our channel and join our cosmic crew as we boldly go where no channel has gone before. So until next time, fellow space travelers, stay curious and may the force of curiosity be with you.